Okay, the first thing we do is introduce ourselves to our customer, and then we're going to explain about the program that we're going to do, uh, what an IPM program is, because the first thing you need to do is educate your customer. First thing we do is we talk about the products that we're going to use and that we use the least toxic products that we can use in the environment to control the infestation. For example, I'm showing her here that we use uh, baits for cockroach infestations, and this is a particular bait that we were we were using that time. We also use insect monitors, and this is so we can evaluate how well our treatments are doing. We can also track the insects that we catch on these to determine what direction they're coming from, where they're going to, uh, to see what life stages we have. It's a very useful tool, and these will be placed in the environment where the insects are. We also talk to her about how she can help us with the uh, infestations that are there. Some of the things that we show her are some of the uh, sanitation that needs to be done. Um, this particular uh, microwave was full of food. Cockroaches can live on this stuff for a long period of time. So we try to let the customer understand that these little scraps are enough to feed a population of cockroaches. And then we're going to show her about the moisture problem that she had underneath this sink. Uh, cockroaches need three things. They need moisture, they need food, and they need harborage. And you can see in this situation where they have plenty of food, plenty of water, and now they have all these cracks in the walls where the pipes come through where they can have harborage.